All right, not much of a repair video, but uh, this is the 94 Honda 300 four trucks that I've worked on a couple of times, posted up videos and stuff. My exhaust died the other day and I did what a couple of guys have recommended, but I didn't really find any videos on it. And I got this Ford tractor exhaust. In fact, you can see that part number up on there. It's a Ford NAA 5230E. This is what replaces it. This is the FO4 exhaust. So it's a, a tractor exhaust, actually. It's got an inlet and an outlet. But what I wanted to show you is, one, I ran this exhaust strap around there and I left it a little bit loose so that it's not binding and shaking the rest of my exhaust system. But I also put this exhaust clamp on there and this tape to kind of create a gasket on there. So my exhaust broke right here, which is where most of them do from what I've seen. And that's because it will rattle and break the exhaust free. And if I had my old one, I'd show you, it actually fell off while we were riding and my son said he picked it up or it fell off or I, I don't know what happened with it. But what I did is I got some of this JB Weld Tiger patch exhaust tape and I'll put a link to it in the comments. And I got an inch and five eighths exhaust clamp or a 41 millimeter exhaust clamp. Same thing. Put that tiger tape around the pipe. It goes back up in here about an inch. I try to center it where this would ride. Wrapped it, wrapped it, wrapped it, wrapped it, wrapped it, and then put this exhaust clamp on there and smashed it down. You can see it. this is beveled to where it will it'll crimp down on there. So it went down on there nice and tight and then just ran, there's already a hole in my frame up here so I didn't have to drill anything. So I just ran that tape up and ran the bolt through all three pieces and it works great. It sounds really good too. You fire it up. 